Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Steve, and I'm back with a new video. But first, let me ask you a question. How many times have you gone to update an app on your iPad, and after updating, you go to look, and you notice that certain apps are blacked out with the word waiting underneath? Well, if that's happened to you like it's happened to me, I've got a solution to help you out, so stay tuned. All right, so recently I was updating some apps on my iPad, and I noticed that afterwards a couple of them were blacked out with the status waiting underneath it. And no matter how many times you long press it and you wait until all of the uh, apps are flashing back and forth, there's no X button to delete it. So you're kind of left wondering what to do and how to get rid of these apps or how to uh, reinstall them. So i got a real simple trick for you. All right, so first what you're going to do is you're going to access your settings menu, and then you're going to go right here to where it says general. You're going to click that. Under general, you want to come over to where it says usage. I don't think this is coming out too good. It's got a lot of glare here. But anyway, you can see where it says usage there. So you want to click usage. All right, so underneath usage, underneath usage, you want to find storage. And that's right at the top. So you see that, right? Okay, so where it says show all apps, you want to tap that. All right, so what that does is that's going to bring up this scrollable list here of all the apps that you have on your iPad. What you want to do is you want to find those apps that are blacked out. Say for instance, I have a calendar app here, Calendars Plus. Say for instance, if that was the offending app, what I would do is I would simply tap it and it would take me into this screen here. Now notice underneath there it says delete app. So what you do is you press that and what it would do is it would delete the app out of here. So then when you come back, if you go into the folder that that app was in, you'll notice that the app still appears to be there, but instead of it being blacked out, now it's going to be completely white. So once you do that, you long press it, and you'll notice that now it has an X. So all you have to do is you press that X, the app is deleted, and now you can go back into the App Store and re-download it. Real simple fix. I hope this helped you guys out, and I'll see you in the next video.